As a hammer-wielding David DePap smashed his way inside the Pelosi home, investigators say he told them he knew this was a suicide mission. Despite clear security, new court documents reveal DePap knew that the ring cameras outside the house captured his entry, but defendant remained undeterred. The suspect was inside the home alone with Paul Pelosi for nearly 30 minutes, arriving at approximately 2 a.m. The complaint says a private security guard working near the Pelosi home the night of the attack saw a man in the area with a large bag. Even after hearing banging, though, the security guard never called police. With the Speaker of the House often the target of violent death threats, NBC News has confirmed Capitol Police in Washington, D.C. have the ability to monitor Pelosi's San Francisco home 24 hours a day. But during the attack, no one was watching the feed. The Washington Post reporting, after seeing flashing lights, officers rewound the footage and could see the intruder break in. In court, DePap, a Canadian national pleading not guilty, but authorities say he admitted to crimes. It's clear from his own statements uh, what his intentions were. After the attack, DePap told officers he had other plans. Defendant named several targets, including a local professor, several prominent state and federal politicians, and relatives of those politicians. Tonight, authorities painting the picture of a madman who easily broke into the home of the Speaker of the House. Miguel Almaguer, NBC News, San Francisco. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.